Hey guys, Matt coming to you from Fanfare. You know the drill, we're gonna check out the new book, so please follow me and let's see what's new coming out tomorrow. Starting off in Marvel, we have a second printing of Amazing Spider-Man 57, a facsimile of Black Knight. That is a very, very neat cover. Uh, we do have a new Black Widow issue there with a Terry Dodson alien variant. We've got Cable, uh, Black Panther Select Edition hardcover there, Captain America, Xenomorph cover. Uh, Champions Outlawed, we have some cool variants for that. We have a Dawn of X paperback volume 13 that comes out. We also have Guardians of the Galaxy, a new Daredevil paperback. This actually gets you up to date to King and Black, so it's only two issues behind, which is crazy. It just came out. We have Immortal Hulk Flatline one-shot tie-in, Iron Fist Heart of the Dragon issue number two. We have Iron Man issue number six, beautiful Alex Ross cover there. Uh, new issue of King and Black, wow, it's crazy. The main book and Venom are so good. Lots of big stuff happens. Leading up to the next issue, which is the finale, it's going to be nuts. The last page was insane. We have a second printing of Gwenum vs. Carnage. This is the Lee in Hyuk variant. Um, check that out. Really cool. Planet of the Symbiotes, issue number two, including American Kaiju. We have Marauders, a Ms. Marvel paperback. We have Marvel, a Silk paperback. Modoc Head Games, yes. And Strange Academy paperback. Spider-Woman, Savage Avenger, King of Black tie-in. Uh, Thor... We have a brand new number one. I'm pretty excited to read this. It's X-Men Legends number one, going back to the 90s team, X-Men Blue. Let's do this. It's gonna be fun. On to DC. Batman Catwoman issue number three, Phantasm on the cover, gotta love that. We have Catwoman, more second printings of the future states. Uh, just a heads up on your email. If you subscribe to those, we can't zap them in the box, so you won't get a notification. But if you did subscribe to them, they're in your box. But if not, don't worry about it at all. They're not in your box. That was probably more confusing than the note. We also have new Wonder Woman Immortal, the next Batman comic. We have Future State and Nightwing, more second printings right here. We have Shazam Future State, Worlds of War, Superman. First issue was fantastic. Can't wait to read that second one. Uh, new Mad Magazine with Spy vs. Spy, they're always fun. Richard Dragon, Kung Fu Fighter. We also have Truth, what does it say? Truth, Justice, Vixen Against it's the Gods. Truth and Justice. Truth and Justice. It's a one-shot. It's a one-shot. On the image, what's up? Heavenly Creatures, Aria. These are really neat because on the back of each issue, you're getting the sketch variant. Very neat. So it shows you the pencils all the way to the full end cover. We have a new issue of Family Tree. Issue number two of Ha Ha. We have uh, Brubaker Phillips, Scene of the Crime. Pretty cool. Uh, Walking Dead Deluxe, new issue of that, colored out. And then onto the indie comics. A lot of cool stuff. We're looking at Abbott 1973. We have American Mythos Monsters, American Ronin, uh, Black Cotton, Barbalian, Black Friday. Crazy, crazy cover there. Bite Sized, Courier, Devil's Highway, Dynamite, Excellence, Grim Universe Quarterly, The Dark Watchers. We have Hollow Heart, a new number one from Vault Comics with a pretty cool throwback cover there. We also have Machine Girl, new issue of Miskatonic for that Lovecraft fix. We have Once in Future. Uh, Penultiman, we have everything else, the picture of everything else. We have uh, the Recount, uh, Red Sonya, nope, that's a variant. This is Sacred Six. Uh, new number one from Valiant, we have Savage. Bring him back a, maybe not bring him back, I'm not sure, but he looks pretty cool, so check it out. Second Coming, uh, Shadow Doctor from Aftershock Comics. We have Steambound, issue number one from Behemoth, Stillwater, Terminal Punks. And then here it is, oh my goodness gracious, TMNT, issue number two of Last Ronin, it's finally here. It's so fantastic. Pulls at your heartstrings. It's got throwbacks galore. It's gruesome. It's just, a, it's so good. Please read that book. I love it so much. Uh, Vampirilla, Dark Powers, We Live, White Light, and Young Hellboy. Not to be confused with Old Hellboy. We have a manga. This is Assassin's Creed, Blade of Shaojun. Uh, we have The Expanse, new issue of that. Uh, Mighty Morphin Power Rangers. I should say it's Mighty Morphin. Uh, yeah. It's Power Rangers, Mighty Morphin Power Rangers, whatever. We got the new issue. It's right there. Um, Stranger Things, Dungeons and Dragons, is issue 4 of 4 for the grand finale of that. And uh, kiddos, we do have kid books. Check them out. Avatar, Last Airbender. We also have a hardcover, Dark Crystal Age of Resistance, The Journey, uh, Forever Home, Power Up, a new issue of Sabrina. Really cool stuff. And Scooby Doo, where are you? Probably trying to solve a groovy mystery. What we got for toys? Let's scope it out. First off, we got Elvis 68 Comeback Special Diamond Collection Entertainment Earth Exclusive Funko Pop. Uh, Raya from Raya the Last Dragon, titular character. 
We also have Elvis and the Jailhouse Rock. For some Simpsons, we got Duffman and Itchy. Scratchy's not here yet, but Itchy's here. We have some really cool throwback to the original Disneyland Park for the 65th anniversary stuff going on there. Uh, new Injustice 2 miniature figure here. This is Dark Side. We also have Wonder Woman 84 figure. Uh, I believe these are fig arts. Um, we have a pretty cool here, Glitter and Glamour Princess Shiroshoshi. I totally botched that. But One Piece, check it out, really cool stuff. A new spectacular Spider-Man with a interchangeable Peter Parker head. And back to that 65th anniversary of Disney, these are really neat. These are actually, I don't know if you can see it, there's a lot of rippling on it. But what they're trying to capture are the original uh, cars that would go on that windmill ride. I'm not sure what you would call it, but these are the original cars that you would sit in. Pretty cool. We also have a My Hero Academia Ben Presto, two of them I should say, as well as some good old Goku and his Papa Bardock to tie it all together there, as well as IG-11 and R2-D2 Funko keychains and the Mandalorian. Whoa, secrets. And Luke and Stormtroopers. Mamma Mia. Just for your droid fix. Thank you for Josh for saving the day there at the end, or else we wouldn't know what we had. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching. If you have any call, questions, give us a call at the store. It's 269-349-8866. Thank you so much. Have a great night.